One of you guys, Peter Thyssen, a fellow Dane from Arizona, US, wrote me this morning and told me there's a new firmware update available for both the Mini 3 Pro and equally exciting for the DJI RC. The update from the Mini 3 is of course uh, interesting to some point, but what makes it super interesting for those of you that still hang on to your Air 2S is that the DJI RC will now support this drone. I can't confirm this as I sold my Air 2S in the anticipation of the Mini 3 Pro. But Peter, he says DJI released a new firmware for the DJI RC that is compatible with the Air 2S. The wait is over. I updated the DJI RC and I'm updating my Air 2S as I type this. So I would assume equally as there is a firmware update for the Mini 3 Pro available on this controller, if you try this and do the upgrade uh, together with your Air 2S, there will be a firmware update for that one as well. Let me know how smooth it goes to make uh, the DJI RC work together uh, with your Air 2S in the comments below. Apart from the DJI RC update, we are also getting added support for FAA's remote ID requirements, which is for the United States, which basically makes remote ID active and it cannot be disabled. And it will require that you install the DJI Fly App 178 or later to fly the aircraft in the US. So that'd be interesting to see what you US fellow colleagues are making out of this. Luckily, that's not a limitation here. Also, Master Shots is now available in uh, portrait mode, which could open for, for some interesting uh, possibilities. Also added shutter priority and ISO priority for the camera in pro mode. Also super nice. Added support for adjusting style parameters as sharpness and noise reduction. Very, very nice. And added support for the wide angle lens. I've not tried that yet, but sounds like an interesting option as well. For you to take advantage of this, it also requires that you have DJI Fly App 178 installed or later versions. So this was just a super fast update. I hope I get time to get everything installed here later today to see what's going on and maybe try out some of the new stuff. If you already tried it, let me know your experience below. I hope you liked this video. If you did, then feel free to give it a like. If you didn't like it, feel free to press the dislike button twice. Thank you for watching and I'll be seeing you around.